Hey guys, Cody here from the Bedrock Emerald, and today, in Blocky Cars, I'm going to make a race car. And, yeah, just a really simple one. Actually, just basically a rundown through everything. So, first of all, I prefer using these blocks, whatever they're called. Because I've uh, been doing multiple tests and the car actually goes faster using these blocks. So, another wheel that I recommend is the buggy wheels. And uh, if you want to get them to work right, all you have to do is this. So yeah, quite basic. Nothing much. Let's add a little more to our car. Because... Alright, probably should put this on. I'm pretty sure this helps you with turning. I'm just pretty sure this helps you with turning. Also, the farther apart you have your wheels, the harder it becomes to turn. So... This is like the closest you can put your wheels at to, for the sharpest to turns. And let's randomly place this on here. Because it makes it look more like a car. Let's uh, find that spoiler. Pretty sure that's what they're called. Hang on. Ah, oh, there it is. So yeah, this helps with speed as well. Actually, I'm going to move it to over here so I can rotate it. So yeah, we have a pretty basic car right now. But, wait, I'm forgetting something important. Because, what if you want to drive on the moon? Now to remove this block, actually, that might be a little important. Let's remove this block and replace it with this. Sure, this block is much heavier, but it allows you to function on the moon just fine. So that's definitely something that you would want. Okay, so we we might want something to speed our car up, right? Let's add some boosters also facing down because. If uh, we are boosting uh, fast enough, uh, we won't be able to touch the ground. It just becomes nightmarish. So, yeah, let's have boosters uh, hitting the ground. Okay. So, yeah, let's continue our little trend here. We have a ton of boosters now. And there's another really popular strategy. It's basically a constant speed boost. Yeah, this isn't looking much like a car anymore, but hey, it still works. It was a pretty common strategy. This, and then, boom. Yeah. Hoverers put down their sides for constant speed boost. This really helps with the car's speed. Yeah, another thing to look forward to is not having your car too wide or else it gets stuck in the tunnels that the, this game loves to put you through. I'm pretty sure uh, this will have troubles with loop-de-loops -loops in the new racetrack. So once you hit them, just turn on your thrusters and turn off your hovers and you should be fine. Because the hovers like to balance you out. Mainly for flying purposes. Just a small downside uh, to look out for. So yeah. This thing's gonna be hugging the ground. Yeah, this might be a little fast for me, but oh well. Nope, nope. Let's see. Yeah, I'm also using consumable blocks if you have not noticed. Because I simply don't have much cash on me now. So let's save our new 
consumable car. Well, let's see if we can actually find a race. Heh, <laughs> I'll be really lucky. Nope. No races. What a shame. I guess we're getting... I guess the testing will have to work. And give it a second to load. Hang on. It takes a while to load. So, let's hit setting. What am I doing here? I want to test the car. Let's see if we get a relatively flat spot. Oh, okay. So, oh, dang, I get stuck. So it starts so slow. And yeah, there you go. Okay, I'm gonna probably regret doing this, but. See? Sometimes, there's too much force going to the front for the car to handle. Which means we have to, you know, go back, rotate a few thrusters, and we should begin. I gotta remember, I made it face uh, forward down. So if I start to edit this, I will have to do something like this. Uh, why? I tried tapping the other thing. So, let's see. Boom. I really doubt this will be enough, uh, so let's get this one on the top as well. So, yeah, we should be good now. So let's uh, test our car again, and hopefully the boost will start pushing it down. Hmm, interesting. Okay, so it's still not quite strong enough to keep back down. Oh. Ugh. Yay. Okay. So, a little bit of extra boost. That's not too impressive. Keeps you on the ground and all. And, uh, yeah. So, we're gonna have to play around with more hovers. And I stepped on something. Oh well. So, let's play around with the... Uh, Let's start rotating some more stuff. Because you really want a balanced car. So, why not to get this entire band? So, it's going to be like this. Hang on. Boom. Because we really need a flat car. If it's not flat, you know what happens. It'll be hard to turn and it's gonna be practically useless. So, let's see. I ran completely out. Right. Right. Is the whole dragging and auto biting work? Nope. Okay, let's save that. Let's test it again. It's ridiculous that the buggy wheels now cost to 700. Oh, this should be interesting. Okay, let's move that out of the way. And it's still not quite. It's a lot better. Yeah, once you uh, mix it with the thrusters, it's good. Yeah, if it's not balanced, nasty things happen. Alright, how long have I been in this video? Okay, I can handle a more. It's messing with me right now.
Please don't make me reload the app. Ah, uh, crashed. Dang it. App crashes is a pretty big problem now. So, uh, let's try this again. Because we almost have it just right. Because uh, the rear is just not heavy enough. Yeah, that's just the thing of the uh, race cars. You have to have it perfectly balanced. Like, you know how I had the thrusters pointing down? Yeah. If the thruster is pointing uh, down, uh, when I use them, I won't have to deal with losing control and ending up flying through the air. That is just n nightmarish. Who knows, maybe I'll record a video of me racing with this thing. Highly unlikely, but hey. So let's edit this some more. And perhaps, let's see. Let's remove, let's move these two to the very back. And rotate them a bit. Because we still want speed, just balance. Okay, this should be it. So now let's test the car. And hopefully it's balanced. Oh hey, what do you know? So yeah, here's the normal speed, it is quite fast. Ah, uh, I can't quite make it up those. Actually, let's uh, find the start. Now, hi, it works great. And a little bit of extra boost and nose tight. Yeah, you might want to turn these off. But so far, it doing great so yeah a pretty basic tutorial for a race car oh it still goes back still able to go backwards so like I said it's probably gonna have trouble getting up here no it did not have trouble yeah there's that uh, cooldown Come on, make it up. Stop this. So yeah, got a good race car now. Uh, yeah, as I told you, it tries to balance. It likes to try to balance things out. So yeah, hope you guys did enjoy this video. Like and subscribe. And well, guess I'll see you in my super fast race car. Well, bye. Also, bare heads up. After this week, I might be taking a break from YouTube. Just a heads up. There's a good chance of it. Because I'm going to be on a plane ride. But, okay. Well. As I said before, like and sub subscribe. And watch me mess up my words at the very end. Well, see you.